What's up, everyone? This is Zelda Destroyer 229, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 12. I just got done with playing a little bit of Kingdom Hearts, so I excuse me if I accidentally hit L2 by accident or R2. Is it R2? It is R2. Last time. <laughs> oh man, last time we defeated some boss that used a uh, gravity field that slowed down our movements. They don't... The names of a lot of these bosses don't really stick well with me. And we opened up the way to reach hopefully, the Sword of Kings. In this episode, we are hopefully going to be able to claim the Sword of Kings. Now before we really get going with that, uh, there was... I did mention that I wanted to make sure that Ash well, that she could cast her spells at a lower cost. So I'm going to go ahead and get her channeling now. And let's see, gain MP after dealing magic damage. Um, I would like the ether. The ether lore, like any of the lores as well as the uh, remedies stuff I would want. I think I got all the remedy stuff for Ash. Uh, that I don't really need right now. Let's go ahead and get her War Mage. So that unlocks Aether Lore and Channeling. Again. Okay, so now hopefully Ash will be able to cast spells at about the same cost as Pinello and Fran. Let's see, is there anyone else that we could potentially use some things with? Um... I kind of want to try to get something with techniques, but I think I'll just hold off on doing that until I see what techniques I can get. In the meantime, potion store more HP. Eh, sure, why not? That's only 20. Let's see, HP critical, gambit, gambit, um, increase magic potency, meh. Increase physical attack damage. Well, I kind of used that up. Okay, I think we're good. I think we are good. Let's move on. Of course, that I do have to take care of these blood gigases again. Okay, um, Ash, go ahead and try to steal from it. I will go ahead and cast Arrow and hope for the best. Brand, just start attacking. Up. Uh, wait, what the heck? Did I tell? I must have told Ash to go after the wrong Gygus. Okay, whoops. Okay, well, at the very least, we got two things from them. We managed to steal what we could. So I guess that's a plus. I guess. Good job, Fran. Okay, quite a few antidotes. And are the statues still going to attack us? No, they aren't. Those guys are just content with just staying there. Okay. Go ahead and attack. They are going after me. Stop going after me. Stop going after me. Okay, now they're going after Fran. Uh, Fran, go ahead and steal. Aw. And it just kind of wailed on you. Try again. Uh-oh. Okay, well, at least we got the Earth Magic side. I will take that. They will die. I will go ahead and heal us. Actually, do do do. So is Ash. I think. Okay, Ash's is still not quite as low as. Pinello's and Fran's. But it is lower. So. There must be another channeling one that Ash. And, or not Ash, that Fran and Pinello have that uh, Ash doesn't. Okay, and then there's this Dark Mare who we kind of obliterated last time. I'm actually gonna go ahead and fight it legit. So let's go ahead and cast Kirga. Fran, go ahead and cast Kirga. And Ash, go ahead and cast Kirga. Everyone cast the healing spells! Wait, what? But it was... You know what? I'm not even gonna try. 
We can go on. That was... Oh, my! It kind of teleported back. Guys? Guys? Uh, I did not expect it to teleport back to where we were. Okay. Okay. That was really strange. We all casted light spells, which should be its weakness. Why did it actually heal? Like this, what the spell was intended to do. Okay, it's also countering us. Whatever. I think we'll be fine. We should be fine. And now Fran is blind. Okay. Fran, go ahead and cast Blindna on yourself. Finello and I will just kind of keep on wailing on it. We seem to be taking it out pretty well. Snake Lash. Well, whatever it was, Ash blocked it, so I'm not gonna complain. And Ash leveled up, hooray! Wait, weren't they all level 29? No, they weren't. Ash is the first one to reach level 29. Well, just keep on getting stronger, I guess. Okay, so heal everyone up. Now we can continue. Oh, more blood gigases, really? Yeah. Whatever. Let's just go ahead and start wailing on him. Shoot you through the pillar! Because video game. Get away from me! Get away from me! Get away from me! Ah. Guys! Kill it! Okay. Now, Fran, go ahead and try stealing. Take that. We got, like, I think that item that I, that I grabbed was the antidote and Fran got the magic sack. Whatever. I don't care. We got items. That's all that really matters. And now there's a door that we couldn't go through before. And, wait, it has an inscription. Wisdom proven. A say now your power. I guess we've proven ourselves. I take back what we said. We did not quite prove ourselves. Okay, um. First things first, do do do. Um. Actually, let's maybe not use that just yet. What is this thing? Matthias. It has reflect and protect. Casting. Wait, what the ice ashers? Okay, um. And it heals? Um... Okay. Need to cast Fyra on the Ashers. Oh, they're weak to electricity. That's not quite what I expected. Okay. Uh, so Fran's doing that. Pinello, go ahead and also cast Thundara on the Ashers. Okay. This... Holy jeez! Okay, um... I'm gonna go ahead and cast Kyrga on Ash. Bran, go ahead and cast Haste. And I'm asleep. I'm still asleep even though I got hit. And uh, come on. Get the spell in! And now I'm almost dead. Oh crap, these freaking Ashers! Okay, um. Vendara. On the Asher. Pinello, go ahead and use a high potion. Okay, we took care of one of them. So now Ash. or. No. Wait, what the? Why can I not target Fran? Is she too far away? 
Crap, she must be too far away. Okay. Ash, go ahead and cast... Um... I need to get rid of these freaking Ashers. Ashers, whatever. Um... Yeah, go ahead and do that. I will... Okay, now I can actually control Fran. Fran! Ugh, go ahead and keep your cure. I will go ahead and cast Kyrga on Ash. Okay. Strange time to level up, but... And now Fran is asleep. Okay, Ash, you go ahead and cast Kyrga on me. I will... I still have an alarm clock, don't I? I have quite a few, yeah. Help me, help me, help me, help me, help me! Okay. Fran, let's go ahead and cast Kira. Um... I will go ahead and cast Blizzara. There's only two of these stupid Azures left. Damn it! Okay. Um, Ash? Ash is also asleep now, but Fran's not. Or, Fran. Pinello's not. Pinello! We still have the stupid Azures. And I can't exactly target one in particular. Crap, okay. Um, then just go ahead and attack this one. Immu Wait, immune? Okay, well, that's not working. Okay, uh, Fran, go ahead and cast Thandara on the Azure. Okay, it's dead. Um, Fran, go ahead and cast Haste on Pinello. Pinello! Go ahead and cast Thundara on the Azure. Uh, Ash, you go ahead and cast Kira on Fran. Okay, Pinello leveled up. The Azures are gone, thank goodness. Now Fran is slowed. Okay, so Fran, go ahead and cast haste on yourself. Um, oh, because Ash's weapon is ice, crap. That's why it's not really doing anything. Okay, um, equipment, Ash, we're gonna have to replace your ice brand. Uh, let's go ahead and give you Flame Tongue again. It won't do as much, but at the very least, it'll do something. Um, Fran? Ah. Okay, at the very least, we can actually deal some damage to this thing. Okay. So now I'm gonna go ahead and cast Cure Ga on Ash. Okay, so that should be good for now. Now that we're actually dealing damage to the boss, let's go ahead and cast Cure Ga again. This time on Pinello. It's casting Reflect, which means our attacks will do some damage back to us. Oh well, I think. Sort of. In fact, not even at all. Not quite sure what exactly that does. But I'm gonna go ahead and cast Cure Gut on Pinello because it really likes to attack Pinello. Flash Freeze, that's not good. Um, well, it didn't seem to really do all that much. However, we are still doing a decent amount of damage to it. I'm tempted to bring in Quickenings. But that may just be for a last resort, like when it's really down low and I can also switch to Vaughn. But right now, we seem to be doing pretty all right. It's not doing anything too terribly bad. All I have to do is just keep hearing whoever is being attacked, which just kind of seems to be Pinello and occasionally Ash. 
Yeah, now sh the boss has turned its attention to... I think it's a female. At least it has a bit of a female form. Turn its attention to Ash, but we're still doing pretty decently well. I could be using spells, but you know what? I think I'll just resort to just using healing. Flash freeze on Pinello. Which dealt quite a bit of damage. Uh, Kirga. Chain magic. What does that do? Oh my! Ow! Okay, let's go ahead and... Kira, let's get everyone. Okay, that helped a little bit, but I need to use Kira again. Okay, those two can just keep on wailing on it. Fran is pretty much out of MP at this point, but I mean, I'm just I'm just running around in circles, and I'm actually getting my MP back rather quickly. Okay. Oh my. That hurt. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cast Kyrga on myself. It's pretty low. Ash is kind of going to town on it. So now, all oh right, Fran's targeting herself. That's why. Uh, wait for it. Wait for it. Switch to Vaughn. Okay, Vaughn. Do to do. Quickening. Red spiral. Let's go. How about some of this? <laughs> ah. Okay, that's one. Intercession. Okay. We got two hits in with these quickenings. If I manage to get like a 17 hit combo when I'm just facing off against that Shadow Mare, okay. then I should be able to do pretty decent on this. At least I can hope. Assuming I can get a good string of combos. I must endure. All right. Doing good. We are doing fine. We should be able to just finish it off at this point. Assuming we can get a high enough chain. Oh my. glow. All right. So what's next? What's next? Oh, just barely! I barely got that in! Jeez! Come on, game! Throw me a bone! I don't think we have enough high enough chain yet. Whatever! Pyroclasm's next! And I think we did get a little bit more of our time back as well. You going down. Oh, just barely! Barely got that in! Okay, so now what's next? After White Whirl, we can get... Intercession! Oh man, I only have less than a second left to use chain. That's not good. But whatever, the more the higher the chain is, the better chance we have of just taking down this boss. Ten hit chain, all right. So far so good, we're not gonna get as high as we did before, but whatever, this is still a good chain going. How about some of this? All right, Heaven's Wrath. We're still doing good, we are still doing fine. Let's just keep it up. No, we're not gonna get another one, and nope. Whatever, a 12 hit chain, that's really good. Yeah, but I saw it, it's like, None of them are lit up. Well, that's the end of that. And our finisher this time... Turret. Wow, we actually skipped one. And that dealt... 
Like 21,000 damage and it was enough! Feels nice when you can just end things off with a huge quickening chain, as opposed to just starting the battle with it. I suppose at this point in the game, it would be better to just kind of go with it. But I obtained the Esper, Mateus the Corrupt! So we've got ourselves our second Esper now. And I believe we have finally finished off the Still Shrine of Miriam after going through that. And now none of us have any MP back left. Oh well, whatever. Are there any chests nearby? Any treasure that suddenly spawn? At the very least, I can just use this time to gather up some MP back. Because I could kind of use it. No, I don't see any treasure. And is it south or north? South. Okay. So now we can just keep heading this way and head on over through this screen transition. So let's go. Whoa. Well, that's interesting. Is, is that the sword up there? It has to be. You should try it on the Dawn Shard. See if it can destroy Nethicide or not. What? He just may be onto something. The Dawn Shard's no use to us, after all. <laughs> the stone bleeds mist. It has been roused. It fears the sword. The stone is quiet. This is the sword, the Nethysite Destroyer. Should it find its mark? Vaughn! Tell me, did you see him again? I didn't. Not a thing. Not even my brother. Not... not anything. Obtain the Sword of Kings. Well... That seems rather interesting. The fact that Vaughn could see something before. 
but this time it was only Ash who could see Prince Rallus. Vaughn couldn't see anything that time. Maybe it was because he was the one that suggested destroying the Nethesite. Well, whatever. We got ourselves a new sword. The Sword of Kings. Um, wow, that's actually really... <laughs> that's actually not that great of a sword. It's a two-handed sword. Attack power of 30. Anyone can wield it, though, and it increases their evade by 9. But... It just doesn't really seem that good. Um, what about Ba- Um, it's about as good as Bosch's javelin! <laughs> um, I may just give it to- I think I will just give it to Bosch. It increases his evade by a bit, and it doesn't really affect him that much. So I may as well just do that. I don't see what good it would do giving it to Ash. Especially since that would remove her shield and lower her attack power drastically. Well, whatever. We got what we came for. We have ourselves the sword. Now we just need to get out of here. Shouldn't be too difficult. All things going well. Which they rarely do. But, whatever. I mean, as long as we can get back to the save crystal, then I can at the very least end the episode off. Actually, hold on. Licenses. Where is this es- There's the Esper. There's Mateus. So Mateus is down here. Um, let's see. So Vaughn can get it right away. Everyone else- Pinello and Ash are really close by, and the other two aren't really that far, so... Uh, it wouldn't- I'm not sure exactly who to give this summon to. I mean, Pinello already has... Uh, Bellius, was it? Uh, if I got him the right person? Yeah, Bellius. So who to give Mateus to, I am not entirely sure. Especially since I don't really use the summons that often. If I usually use the mischarges, it's typically quickenings, but... Eh. Nice to have the option available. Okay, it seems like we're gonna need to fight our way through the Blood Gyguses again. Oh, well, whatever. We got through them before. And I really should have sent the others to attack. Ah! Good try. Whatever, you can't get me. Nah, 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 nah. Okay, well, whatever. We just need to just take care of these blood gyguses. And then just... Oh, good job, Vaughn! We just need to take care of the blood gyguses, get back to the save crystal and save, then make our way out of the still shrine. Once we reach that, then we should... We would probably head back to Boromi Sace then. And I'm starting to get the crap beat. Starting to get the crap beaten out of me. Okay, Vaughn, you go ahead and try to steal from it. But yeah, I mean, really, all we need to do afterwards is... Ooh, it's up to Phoenix down. I mean, yeah. We just really need to head back to Boromi Sace then, and then just... It's just really where to go from there. Because now we have the sword, so now we can cut Nethesite. So that will make us a formidable force when it comes to the, the Empire in trying to use Nethesite. However, oh, yeah. However, really, it's just how to best utilize that. Oh boy. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh, do 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 do. Kyrga on Vaughn. Vaughn, you don't have time magic, so you can't really do anything. Vanello, go ahead and use haste. Ow. You know what? If I can get their attention on me, that'd be great. Okay, let's just take care of this one. 
Crap, 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 crap! Okay, antidote. Vaughn, go ahead and cure me up. Then go ahead and try to steal. I will cast Kira. Because we could all use it. Vaughn, why are you not freaking trying? There you go. There we are. Now we just need to kill it. Ow. Okay. Then we just need to go through two more of these Bellius or Belliuses. Gyguses. <laughs> Bellius is, is one of my summons. Okay, Vaughn, go ahead and try to steal. Ow. He couldn't steal. Try again. Because I could use some money. Vaughn. There we are. Okay, then try to steal from the one that actually has health. Okay, good job, Pinello. Vaughn, try again. Come on, this is just one final guy, and then we can end things off. Vaughn! Come on. You're supposed to be a good thief. Damn it, Vaughn! Whatever. It's down. We can now go this way. We can save, and then we can make our way out of the still shrine. So, next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy XII, uh, we'll make our way out of the Still Shrine. Our business here is done. We have the Sword of Kings, and now we can actually put it to use in the war against Arcadia. Hopefully, Larsa is feeling a little bit better. Hopefully, like, the realization of the circumstances is... I know, I know it's really tough for Larsa, but hopefully he'll be all right so that he can travel with us again really soon. If not, that's completely understandable. But next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy XII, we'll go ahead, make our way out of the Still Shrine, make our way back to Boromi Says, hopefully, and we'll see where the story goes from there. So until next time, everyone, take care.